Okay, so um, you observed that a pattern in moon phases as you modeled the moon orbiting the earth. So something we observe to be similar over and over and over again is a pattern. So we took the, our moon sphere and, and we made it complete an orbit or, or of the earth, which was your head. And in reality, like we said <clears throat> in the sim, it takes about one month for the moon to orbit the earth. So every time we take a moon around the earth in this, we, we see the same moon faces in the same order. And that's a repeating pattern. So this should help answer our investigating question. So every time we go around the moon, we start at new moon, we then see a crescent, then we see a quarter moon and so on. So that should help you, I think. So an important idea in science is in that the world behaves in consistent and predictable ways. So in our model, you observed a consistent pattern of moon phases. So when scientists observe a consistent pattern in the natural world, such as the phases of the moon, they can assume that a similar pattern likely occurred in the past and will likely occur in the future unless factors affecting it change. So in the next, so that's kind of just the helping you understand patterns. So now you're going to um, understand what you're gonna do for the assignment. So in this Nearpod, it's just a link to help you to, the lesson is just a link and you're gonna do the assignment in the discussion board. So you're gonna do um, a routine called the write and share and I'll explain that in the next video.